house power wash the other day. Someone said, David, when was the last time you had your, power, your house power washed? I couldn't remember. It's been that long. And I hired a service and they came out and they climbed up on ladders and they sprayed all this detergent and all this business. And I had yuck raining off my house that I was not very proud of, but I'm proud of it now. It looks great. Now, one thing that really is tough, unless you hire a professional company like I did and you end up paying a lot for it, which I did, um, you need a great cleaner to get after some of those areas. Now, when dirt collects on the shingles of your house and a hard rain washes them down over your downspouts, you ever get those little um, drip stains on your gutters and downspouts? And have you ever tried to clean those off? It's virtually impossible. You spray it with GP66 and it comes off like magic. You want to be able to emulsify grease in your home? Comes off like magic. This is an amazing cleaner. When you have tried everything else, if you've not tried GP, you've not tried everything. And I call it GP because GP and I have known each other a long time. We're on a first name basis. If you don't know it quite so well, you might call it GP66. This is my mother's favorite cleaner. My brother and I were home visiting one time and she was in the kitchen. She has a glass stove top. And she was cleaning burn rings while my brother and I were finishing breakfast in the other room. And she came in to talk to us and say something. She had a, a, a bottle cleaner under her arm. I said, Mom, what is that? She said, oh, it's that GP66. I got it from QVC. I love it. It's the only thing I can find that will take care of the burn rings on my stove. This is amazing stuff. Whether it's brake dust on a car, it's algae on the side of your house from not having power wash since, I don't know, Bush was in office. And then you've got a situation where you've got to pre-treat collars before you put them in. This is going to be amazing. Now, if you bought these big, two big 32-ounce bottles, at retail, you'd be looking at almost $40 if it purchased separately. Today, we're going to do the same two bottles for $30.35. You use them right out of the bottle, full strength. This is amazing stuff. If you're going to use it on something where you're not sure about color fastness, use it on a little uh, discreet area first. But I'm going to tell you, pet stains, pre-treating laundry, whatever you've got going on, this is amazing. Use it on a food service. You want to use it, uh, you want to rinse it with potable water. What is potable water? It's a fancy word for fresh water. So if you're going to use it on your barbecue grill or anywhere where, you, where food is handled, then you want to uh, rinse that area with potable water. All of this comes together for you at a great price. And the company that makes this product only makes this product. And for the longest time, they made it great big drums and they sold it to commercial um, companies to use as cleaners. Then we begged and begged and begged and pleaded, and they started making it on a retail size for our customers. This is an extraordinary product, and a member of our GP66 team is Kylie Watts. Joining us now live via Skype to talk to us about all the great things that you can use with this product. And Kylie, you and I presented this item more times than I can count. I'm a huge believer in what GP can do, and I know you know GP as well. That's why you call it by its first name, GP, not GP66, but GP. That's right. Thank you so much for having me, David. We are on a first name basis as well with, with GP, but you said it beautifully. No, this is a, a product that's been here at the queue for over a decade. Back in the day, you could only get it in big 55 gallon drums and every single night it would clean millions and millions of square feet of auto, uh, auto body shops, arenas, cafeterias, schools, you name it. So now when we brought it to the queue a decade ago, you truly have the power of the pros in your hands. And if you've never used it before, there is no other cleaner like GP66. This is a commercial base degreaser and degrimer that was formulated back in 1966 to clean diesel engines. So if it can tack something as dirty as a diesel engine, imagine the job it's going to do in your kitchens, in your bathrooms, in your automobiles, indoors and out, because frankly, David, you are going to use GP66 just about everywhere. It's one of those cleaners that when you start to run out, you panic and you go back and hope that the queue has it in stock to buy more and more because it really will do the job of so many other cleaners and frankly, do it better. It really is the power of the pros from indoors, outdoors, even as a pre-treater on your carpets. And then of course, in the bathrooms for the mold, the mildew, the soap scums, and you'll be hard pressed to find anything better to tackle all the grease and grime on your automobiles, your grills, anywhere you have that burnt on mess, this cleaner will emulsify that bond that it has on contact and leave those areas sparkling clean. There are the downspouts. I'm telling you, mm -hmm. when the dirt comes off those shingles, it stains the downspouts and you try to mark that, you try to clean that off with a regular a sponge and some soap and water, forget about it. It's not, and even a power washer struggles with it. 
So this is going to be something that gets in there and really gets after it. Now, Kyle, you've got a great demonstration. Yeah. Above every stove in America, there is probably a filter like that one, making sure that all the crease gets trapped as it comes floating up, right? Mm -hmm. And you know the story, David. Back in the day, I actually purchased a home that was built in the 50s that had the original hood. And every time we walked in, the house smelled like bacon. And we couldn't figure out why until we looked underneath the hood of that range. And what we saw was years and years of grease built up that carries that odor. So with GP, like I said, this will emulsify on contact. So the second we start to spray this, you see how it's breaking down that grease and that grime going to help to tackle those odors as well. So something like your ovens, these hoods, you want to clean these out, give them a little spritzes. And as you said, if it's something where it's a cooking or eating surface, you want to rinse it with potable water. So we can just stick it right in the water, let the GP66 go to work. But before I did that, I actually put down some permanent marker here as well, because this company, again, great family run company out of Baltimore, Maryland, was employed to also help beautify the city of Baltimore, get graffiti off buildings. It can tackle things like spray paint, things that you would think are permanent. So here's our permanent marker. I can spritz this as well, and it'll immediately start to break down that marker. I can use my fingers even just to take it a step further, and that's why we love GP. So if you've used other cleaners in the past and you felt like they didn't do anything, maybe smeared around that grease and that grime, that's why you want to try this. So that permanent marker is completely gone. So from tile to linoleum to the grease-based stains to leather to your shoes, even high-touch areas, you can spritz some on your towel. It could be your remote controls, your keyboards that you're touching. And you'll be horrified at the amount of grease and grime that comes off of these surfaces. I mean, things like your smoker, your barbecue grill. I mean, we're here at the end of summertime, but a lot of us are going to keep grilling right up through October, probably into November. And then how many of you are going to smoke your turkey in your master belt smoker? Ha do you know how long it's been since you cleaned the smoker? My producer just asked me, Kylie, should I use GP66 inside my smoker? I went, mm-hmm. Yes, you should, without a doubt. What have you there, my dear? So we always talk about this when we present the Campanelli mops. You know, best microfiber mops on the planet, but sometimes you get some really nasty stains that you need. You can use this on your floors, on your tiles, on your walkways. So you could literally just spritz your mops that you have at home, or you can go ahead and just spritz the tile. And I know, David, you can't see the floor, but what you can see right now is that this is a clean mop head. And just watch in a matter of seconds, after I give this a couple spritzes, everything that it's going to pick up. So those high traffic areas, this is a cleaner that's great for the floors in your showers too. You get the mold, the mildew. We have a well, so we always get that kind of like red ickiness that builds up in the showers. So in a couple of seconds, check out all the dirt that was on the floor, that GP broke down. The kids aren't playing on that. The dogs aren't playing on that. It's all trapped right there. So that's why this cleaner is so great. You're going to use it in so many different places. Oh, did we lose your audio there, Kylie? I got you, David. Now, I, you, you cut out on me for a sec, but I got you. So oh, I don't good, know what you good, just good, said. good, good. <laughs> and I love that you're able to get into those grout lines. You're able to get into those areas where that are hard to clean because GP is designed to get in where other cleaners fail. When you need to clean inside the oven, just rinse it with some potable water. That's a fancy word for fresh water. If you've got stains, lifelong stains inside your old sink, if you've got green algae on the back patio, on the steps, or collecting around um, oh, the railings on your deck. This is all going to get after all of that. It can make all of that disappear. One of the reasons I had the house power wash now is because I don't want to go into the fall and winter season when we're just going to get bombarded by all of this bad weather and then come the springtime and I've got a real mess on my hands. So I wanted to be able to get out ahead of that. Brake dust is something you usually have to go after with a hammer and a chisel, but not if you've got GP66. If you've got a grill, if you've got those downspout stains, I'm telling you, this stuff is like magic. We have 1,500 sets remaining. I beg your pardon, now 1,400 sets remaining. This is $30.35. Ordinarily, two of these at retail would be almost 40 bucks. We're at $30.35. And I'm going to tell you, Kylie, I have been with QVC 955 years. And this <laughs> is one of the best cleaners I've ever presented, I've ever personally used. I keep this in my house. When I've tried everything else, I'm like, wait a minute, why didn't I try GP66? I just go and grab my bottle of GP, and it does the job the first time. Yeah, and I've been at QVC for 16 years, not quite 900 and change, but I agree with you 100%. This is by far the best cleaner that I've ever had the honor to present to. And again, clean towel right here. And David, as someone who spends a lot of the time in the kitchen and cooking, as you know, we get a lot of those grease-based stains. So a lot of the times we're rubbing, we're scrubbing, things are burnt on. 
spritz GP, give it a couple seconds to start to break down that grease and that grime. And what you'll find is it immediately starts to melt a lot of those surfaces. So I can just go along here on the stove top, matter of seconds, there's all the dirt we picked up. Wow. You also taught me this too. So I'm gonna flip this so we have a clean surface, your cabinets, right? Because as you said before, grease goes everywhere. We cook up that bacon, it kind of splatters. It doesn't just go in the oven, it becomes airborne and then attaches itself. So we need a cleaner that's gonna break it down. So even though this cabinet doesn't look dirty at all, of course it's gonna get a little shine because we're using a liquid on it. What you'll find when you get this home and clean is look at all that. Look at the grease that look we had on Look at what was hiding on, on Cuddy, and Cuddy's a good housekeeper. I know Cotty well. I mean, I, I've known Cotty forever, <laughs> and Cotty's an excellent housekeeper. But you know what? No matter how good a housekeeper you are, grease happens mm -hmm. to nice people. And it lands not on just horizontal surfaces, it lands on vertical surfaces. I mean, if you stand still long enough after you fried chicken, I mean, you're going to have grease on you. So this is what True. it's all about, I'm right? So don't miss well, out on this. And if you've got, and, and, I'll t and I've used GP for this also, I have some of those white soled shoes from Bionic. They get all scuffed and yuck. They look great when they're clean, but when they're when they're dirty, they look terrible. I get on there with my GP and, and scrub those white soles, and they come off really, really pretty. Yeah, and to your point, David, grease gets on you. You can use this as a pre-treater for your laundry. You can use this to clean up your shoes, the grass stains that you have right here. Even on your leather purses, it's going to help emulsify all that grease and grime. You truly have the power of the pros when you get QB66 home, and that's why it's been here at QVC for over 10 years. And Kali, a quick question. Can I use it on leather? Yes, you can. Always test for color fastness on fabric surfaces, but it's a great cleaner on leather. All right, wonderful. Um, also, I'm going to check with my producer, Fran. Fran, I'm not seeing my show showing up on Facebook, and so people are not able to do that. So if we can ask our master control friends to look into that, that would be awesome. Thank you, sir.